headed into the Smokies and I'm headed up to that tower right in the middle. Shuck stack. Right there. All right, for reference, in that black dumpster, there's a guy in green. It's a pretty tall dam. It's a damn tall dam. This is freaking amazing. All the way out here, the G590 boys. This is awesome. I hope they're out there and I meet them. I just realized that I have now walked the Appalachian Trail from Springer Mountain to Davenport Gap. Because I've already done the next 72 miles. But to be a through hike, I have to do them again. That kind of sucks right now, but <laughs> I do love the Smokies, so. What's, what's six days of walking over mountains, right? Here we go. Legit. Now I just had to climb like 3,000 feet to Shuckstack Tower. It is. It's only three and a half miles, 2,297 feet. It's only like 600 feet a mile. It felt, it felt like worse coming down. I'm good with that. I've come up to 490 feet and 0.6. And I've just got a sweat running down me. It's like oh, nine in the morning or something. I got sweat running down my arm right now. Drip it off my elbow. It is humid. Thank God it is not sunny. Almost there. Just 2.9 miles and 1,800 feet to go. 11 a.m. Here's the time that I started. Just in case you're wondering, climbing this thing is absolutely terrifying. But I'll get a view. Step down the hole. There's no safety. <laughs> well, there are railings. That's a chimney from when there was a little cabin here for the caretaker or tower watcher or whatever. That's a person in orange. So, this is what's holding you in. Super steep. <laughs> so remember um, from the early days, seems like months ago, Trey Mountain Shelter, there was a family with a, like a two and a half year old and a six month old. Well, I found out they're actually through hiking. So if they make it to Maine, that's pretty awesome. Um, I hope they do. They're nice people. Um, I'm going to do my best not to camp with them. Uh, they're, like I said, they're nice people, but I just don't want to camp with a baby. Um, they had some friends come out and do trail magic and stuff. So I guess what I said about, uh, wishing that they would have gone to a state park or whatever, isn't really an option since they're through hiking. So, uh, my bad. <laughs> um, but no, they are really nice people. Um, 
we talked to them and their friends for a couple, well, probably at least a half hour yesterday. Uh, me and uh, that young dude brother who was in the picture by the fire. Uh, we had a good time yesterday. And uh, so far today, my legs are feeling great. I'm at Gregory Bald Trail and the AT. I stopped here with my dad last September. And I'm gonna try to eat some lunch now. Dirty boy. So this is what I bought to last me five days. Um, <laughs> it's nowhere near enough calories. Ugh. But I just don't feel hungry. So I guess we'll just go with it. That's like one, two, three, four, five lunches. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five breakfasts, and a snack. Jimmy, calm down. And another snack. I said calm down, Jimmy. This is what I call spam and a tortilla. It's phenomenal. I might wash it down with some um, olive oil. And I put way too much fruit punch in my drink. And I'm basically out of water, so I'm just going to have to drink super fruit punch. I have nowhere near enough food if I get hungry. And I think I'm starting to get hungry. Um, I just did a shot of olive oil. E-V-O-O, extraversion olive oil. That stuff is sp spicy, like not good straight. So I don't recommend it. But if you want to know what, so I had spam and a tortilla times two and a shot of olive oil for lunch. It's 500, 600, 7, 8, it's about 900 calories actually. Um, and I guess I had a Snickers bar and then I had two carnation instant breakfast and something else for breakfast, I think. Oh, please don't get hungry right now because I don't want to go to Gallenberg or Cherokee. I got bugs all over me. I'm gonna get moving because these little bastards are all over me. Oh yeah, it's probably a good idea. Hey man, <laughs> there's a bear behind it back there. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, it's like pig. Been pig. Oh, okay. So is it a three later? Is it? Uh, okay. Yeah. Gotta make sure it goes down. 
It's not really pig defense as much as pig eradication. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, those pigs, they can charge you, man. Yeah, uh, yeah. Often. Maybe not here. Maybe 175, 200 pounds. He's bigger. Yeah, he just crossed. Yeah, you can see him. Here come bear to wreck your world. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> little guy, though. I told him before we came out here, if a bear shows up and it's ready to fight, I'm fighting it. But if he run, if he turns and runs away, I'm hunting him down like the Revenant. <laughs> I'll find you. You're gonna fight trail. a bear. If it comes down to it, mm -hmm. what, what else are you gonna do? <laughs> hmm? you can't run from it. I mean, you are in the hammock. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. You are the burrito. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Soft burrito over there. And how many times you've heard people, oh, I'm just going to fight the bear. Yeah. All the time. Every time. He's like, sure. sure. The, bear, the bear will just run away before you get the chance, but. Has anyone ever asked you when you let the bear out? No. We get that a lot, don't we? When do you let the deer out? It's right there. Never. Where did the deer come on now? Yeah, where did you go? Right there. Right through the tree. I see. Mm -hmm. yep. <laughs> How long has he been around? Oh, about 45 minutes. Yeah. So, like, as soon as I laid down. We were watching. Just like zoning out, listening to my book. And then I just hear you guys chatting. Yeah, there he is. <laughs> what? so <laughs> cool. I heard you talking about this. Yeah, he's probably heading down towards the water. Bunnies, to bobcats, I mean, just everything. That's so cool. Good grass, the flowers. Yeah. It would be awesome to see a bobcat out here. The worst, like the only downside is when you're hunting with them, like branches don't really show up for well. Yeah. So like, I shot at the branches. <laughs> <laughs> They'll move. I'll sleep here tonight instead. No, I'm gonna definitely sleep in the shelter. Thank you. <laughs> the mice, Second story. The mice are a lot more appealing. I would. Mm, <laughs> I am okay with the mouse tonight. Nice man. I'm just kidding. <laughs> nice. It's only a pretty weird mess. I heard it's a little I tried it. I buy a ball of this. I'm looking at getting our food bags and I thought I tried to grab it. I was going to grab it and look them out of there. Every time I passed around the mice, I hard as shit though, so. <laughs> I told myself I'd be a mouse. Never seen I was just saying, never saw a bear. My whole life living in the UP, only you know, back of trucks. And there's one right there. But he's crossing. Yeah. It's in the water. Slowly heading up his way. He's kind of slowly heading up towards them. <laughs> Mine and he's 
got he's got, got one. My, I got one too, but I'm not gonna blow up my hammock. So. Okay. Yeah, that might be nice tonight. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 